Hello, everybody. My name is Sid Victor, and welcome back to Balatro. We are going to pick it up right where we left off after yesterday's episode with the yellow deck continuing the run here. Um, I will admit that I was not planning on recording today. I wanted to just continue to uh, just play a few rounds of Balatro. Then I forgot that we still had this one going, so we're we're just going to continue it. I'm not gonna I'm not gonna end it, but depending on how long or how short this one goes, we'll definitely, of course, get another run in. Obviously, we have all of our negative. Uh, Joker space here. We also have the Steel Joker, which goes really, really hard. And, of course, the negative Hanging Chad, which we have been absolutely dominating with. We're just going to pick it up right where we left off. If you missed part one of this run, make sure you go check it out on yesterday's video. And, again, thank you all very much for all the support. I really appreciate it. I know that everyone's been pogging out over the Balatro content lately, and, and I have as well. So, uh, yeah, let's pick it up. I got to – when you, whenever I, re like – resume of Balatro run, I have to remind myself in my brain, like, hey, by the way, this is what we were doing here. So I remember this was a three of a kind to a four, four of a kind, um, even like a high card uh, deck that we were doing. So yeah, so know that we have plenty of money here. Oh uh, man, we get $15. We also get two tarot cards. I really, I really like, like to try to spin. I, I want, I legit want to get <laughs> I really, 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 really want to get this to... I, I have never seen the wheel pay out. I'm going to do the smart thing and go for the Emperor just because it's too much value here. We get the Fool, which is going to give us another one. Or uh, we can use the Hierophant and... Uh, yeah, I mean, we can we can hold the Fool until we end up getting a, a Chariot card, which makes us... Which allows us to uh, to make a Steel card. So I think we're going to do that. Let's reroll the Jokers here. Hallucination. Uh, oh, man. Clever Joker as well, but we we're already pretty much well down this road here in terms of Joker builds. So, oof, small blind here. Okay, so we have the mouth. Everyone knows it's the boss that I hate, only basically because of the wording on this one. But apparently, I'm the only one who who thinks that it's it's worded crazily. So, okay, so we can play the uh, we can play the high card of Jack of Spades here. It wouldn't be too bad. Obviously, we want to try to mulligan for some uh, some extra. Maybe some extra aces, so we got plenty of time to discard. We have, I mean, we have six hands to play, so let's do this here. Okay, we got some kings in hand. Good. We also got a steel seven, so that's two steals. Yeah, I think that this, I think this, I think this jack of spades goes hard right here. Yeah, I'm just gonna play it. I don't even care, man. Well, hang on, hang on, hang on. I forgot we have obelisk. Let's see. Pair is our, it is our most played hand, so we can't do that. So we have to play high card here. I'm glad that the obelisk like kind of like jittered there for a little bit because I would I would have forgotten about that. Oh my god, that was 128 grand off of playing one jack, dude. <laughs> <coughs> All right. Yeah, I really don't like the green joker. Um, let's go for a standard pack. We need more kings. We can add a queen here because we do have some more queens, and we can, of course, always increase it with a strength card. Uh, Jumbo Celestial, yeah, we got we got money like that. Three of a kind, straight four of a kind. Gotta go four of a kind. We're we are buffing those high end those high end hands are real strong. Ceremonial dagger. I've tried a ceremonial uh, dagger build. It didn't really work out for me that well. Three of a kind, level up, sure. Ooh, we get a spectral. I, honestly, I'm just gonna go for it. I can't pass up spectral. Converts all cards in a random suit as a gold seal to one selected card in hand. This is all, all bad. All bad. Um. Yeah. Yeah. Let us. I mean, I get yeah, fine. I'll use the sigil. This is not a great play, though. All right, so we got to go to the mouth here. Obviously, this is going to completely bone our obelisk play here, unless if we end up having enough room to play high card. We can play two high card hands. Um, so we need to really mulligan hard here for a face card. We have three three kings in hand and also two steel cards in hand already. So that's really good. If we can get a fourth king, maybe. Um, 
I didn't mean to do that. Four, we have not played maybe four of a kind, so that could be our play here. We got another steel card, man. We can play high card here. It's not a face card, unfortunately. But it is a it is a multi card here for Ace of Diamonds. Uh, you know what? I'm gonna play it. Let's see how much this gets us. We have so much, so many multipliers in our hand right now. It's like actually kind of sick. That was a hundred and seven thousand. Uh, we've got three kings still. Again, I think we just mulligan. We just we just draw hard for something, anything here. Another ace, and it's a foil. Yeah, it's over. And uh, checking our high cards, we're at seven right now. So this will go to eight, but we're still going to maintain our obelisk multiplier for this hand. Yeah, no problem. Look at that. Okay, Supernova uh, adds the number of times a poker hand has been played to the multi. Not really great because we... We've been limited by obelisk, and and that's something that like I'm kind of like not digging uh, with obelisk is that it really does limit your deck to I think a really big detriment. But neither here nor there. Okay, let's see. We got a hermit card, star card. Hermit gives us it doubles our money. I mean, we can use that. And then we honestly we can use the fool and just double our money again. I know that we were. I know that we were saving it for for a rainy day, like if we end up getting a steel card, but we could also just easily just draw, like we could also just easily draw like a, a strength card, so. Mission card. Um we can make a queen, but eh. Give me a give me a lucky joker. Why not? No, why not? Let's let's just go for some luck here. You never know. At 41 bucks, I'm looking very good. Um, and card sharp pretty much makes obelisk obsolete. Um, times three multiplier for poker hand has already been played this round. Yeah, I'm sorry, obelisk. I, I I'm, I'm kind of, I'm kind of tired of you, dude. Get out of here. Give me the card sharp. Now we're not limited in our hands. Now we are liberated. And we can do whatever we want now, which is really, really nice. I'm going to take the strength card. Obviously, that's huge for us to have on hand. Um, I guess I should have used judgment before. So Earth, full house. Yep. Got to give us that. We want to, we want to keep raising our floors here. Supernova, vampire. Uh, the fact that it removes the card enhancements really kind of not great, in my opinion. So loyalty card, that was one that we got very, very confused on. I think that it's just too much of a gamble because you have to play so many hands. It's just, to me, that's just not worth it. So death card is fantastic. Um, honestly, I don't really like the hero font. We don't need the chips here and the death card can make us, we can make another, another king. So let's go to the next round. Mega Celestial, economy tag doubles our money. And uh, then we have the head, 1.12 million. All heart cards debuff, of course. Of course, right after, right at, I swear this this has, this game is troll engine. Because we right after, the reason why we use that, I don't like using the sigil that makes everything one suit. Then we get something like this, of course. So not a great, not a great start here to this hand, although we did get a steel card. Okay, it's looking a little bit better. We can create two more kings with the strength card here. Then we can create another steel card here or make another king. Let's see what we can draw here. Oof, man. Making another another king would be fantastic. Let's take the three. Oh, baby. 
I just want to see what this jack is going to do. This hat, this jack's going to be massive. Oh my god, 2,000 multiplier. We have so many kings! <laughs> just for S's and G's, I just want to see what us playing four kings would do with a four of a kind. No, it's oh my gosh, so many more points for playing a four of a kind. Holy smokes. Wow. Okay. Four of a kind is our bread and butter. Got it. Got it. I mean, we can use the moon card to try to counter the boss a little bit. Give me Earth. Uh, I guess we'll level Mercury. This is going to be difficult. Sell this to disable the boss blind. Ooh. We have we don't we, we really can't We can't get rid of anything. I mean we just we're stuck. We're we're locked. We are essentially locked on jokers in my opinion. Faith card is huge again. Okay. What is the benefit of, of going up against the big blind now versus skipping and getting some money? We lose the chance. We we're really not doing anything with this judgment card. We we need to get an we need to get another another tarot card. But yeah, we can beat this big blind. Okay, and there's a jack. I'm gonna, I'm gonna dump the ace just because four of a kind was just too strong. I'm gonna keep the jack because it is a face card. Okay, we've got another king. That's good. And another steel card in hand. And another steel card. Okay, so this jack should do work here. Not a lot of work, but it should do some work. Honestly, not as much as I thought it would. No, actually nowhere near as much as I thought it would. So we're going to have to play the King of Hearts here. We have four hands left. Play the lucky joker and try to go for a full house. Let's see, much, let's see how much this gets us. Oh no! I didn't play it over. I forgot to move these. Oh wow, yeah, that was worth a lot. Even even getting rid of the steel sevens, we were able to get over a million. Okay, honestly, we need this to counter the boss. So we could turn some hearts into something else. Hermit. Hermit doubles our money now. Aces are good. Judgment doesn't help us.
Mime re-triggers all card held in hand abilities. Does that mean it's going to trigger Aaron as well? Because if so, then that makes it significantly better than the Cavendish. Unless I'm, un I'm misunderstanding the wording here. Well, no, actually, it's better than the Steel Joker. We haven't really been seeing any other Steel cards, but this is better than a Steel Joker right out the gate. Okay, I think we... Yeah, we need max. We just need maximum multiplier here. If this works the way I hope it does, this might go insane. We'll find out. Death card's good. Um, yeah, we have to get rid of the strength card. I hate doing it, but I'm right now. I'm I'm playing to counter the boss. Oh, baby. Well, it's only a one and a half multiplier. Yeah, I mean, po being polychrome is nice. Don't get me wrong, but it's not, it's not something that we need here. Yeah, I think that we're just ready. I think we just send it. Okay, so any hearts, any important hearts, we can, we can literally get rid of a lot of hearts here. This is three. This is six, and this is eight. So we can get rid of eight hearts in our in our deck if we have to. All of this was done in preparation to counter the boss here. Yeah, and that this is exactly what I'm talking about. So we need to we need to start converting now. The jack is not really that important, but if we end up drawing trips. Yeah, I mean, if we're gonna use, we ha we have to convert three cards. So let's just do it. Yeah, you know, screw you, boss. I wouldn't mind getting a boat here, although no, we need we need to go for Jax because because of uh, mime. We want we want the kings and hands to trigger. Although I wonder what happens if we just play this king. Let's discard first and see what we get on the first discard, and then we'll make a decision. Don't, we don't need to use the star yet. This is this also going to trigger the steel car? Oh my gosh, this is this is about to go stupid, y'all. I just want to see what this does. I, I want to see what what playing one one king here does. wasn't as much as I thought it would be. Okay. And I really didn't want to have to use the star. But what we can do... That was a, that was a, I, I was just trying to make something happen here. So what we can do is we can get this king. Okay, I know, I know what we're going to do. I know what we're going to do. We death card the steel card now. Left turns to right. We're going to convert this king a diamond. We might as well do the jack as well. Then we play four of a kind. That's half a million. Not as much as I thought it would be.
Three of a kind doesn't get as much. We, we cannot afford to give up the steel cards in our hand right now. Come on, lucky card. Look at all the... And, that, and that's why I didn't want to burn the... That's why I did not want to burn those. Sigil, Sigil completely screwed us here. This king does nothing. It, it might, it might even break. Need the Jack to proc plot for a lucky card here. No, we can't we can't even play Ace of Hearts because it's it's gonna take over the for the, the high card. Come on, lucky card. Oh, we're so close. get 200,000 off of one king. I'm going to go for it. I mean, we just have to. We did it. Oh, baby. That was so close. Woo. That was real close. Oh, man. I didn't think we were going to get there. Just barely squeaking by. Whew. Man. Uh, yeah, director's cut for sure. So we don't get in that situation again. Good Lord. Oh, man. These are all, these are all bad. These are all bad. I guess maybe we're incentivized to to not have repeating not have repeating suits just in case something like that happens again. Four of a kind. Going to Mars, baby. All right. All right, all right, all right, all right, all right. Uh one reroll because that leaves us enough space to reroll the boss. All club cards are debuffed. No, we we don't need this. We we need a negative Joker. Fourteen million, dude. How in the world are we going to do that? That's the arm is is horrible. And this gets us some solid money here. Let's not waste. Let's not race waste uh, discards right now. Let's, let's just play this. Get some money so we can re-roll that horrible, horrible boss modifier. Man, I think we, I think we might be cooked no matter what. There's the scaling in this game gets out of control. I don't know how we're supposed to do this. I don't think our deck is strong enough for this. That was 18 million for one jack. Face card. This is gonna be 
considerably less. Got it. We got a lot of multis in our hand. Wow. We're still we, we are still getting bodied right now. Oof. I guess let's just see what happens here with the king. Hopefully it doesn't shatter on us. Holy 13 million for one king. Maybe we do have a chance. Wow. But that was with a that was literally with an entire hand. That was with an entire hand of uh, of uh multipliers. Man, I don't know what we're going to do here. We need to, we have to re-roll the, the boss blind. I mean, we just have to. Oh, it won't, it just won't let me. Oh, man, that sucks. You can only re-roll it one time. I'm starting off with quads. Oh, baby, okay. We have four multipliers here. Let's get rid of the seven because it's doing nothing for us. Yeah, that, that didn't do much. Better. I mean, we have so many multipliers in hand. Our, our whole hand is, is multipliers here. Forty two thousand. We have nothing but kings. Hundred and five thousand. This is gonna go crazy. The red seal. <laughs> okay. Okay. I mean we we've got I, I underestimated the, the high card plays here. We're gonna need some good tarot card draws here. We get the fool, which is level of four of a kind. Steel card, I mean, the steel card at least allows us to get some help, but at this point, I think we level up four of a kind. Okay, let's hit up hit up the Arcana pack here. Hermit, Star, Bonus Cards, Temperance, another Steel card. We might as well make another Steel card, I guess. It's, the only problem that I have with the Steel card play is that it just forces us to hold another non-king in our hand. But in a bind, I guess we could use another multiplier in hand. In deck, so fun card. Press the obelisk again. I mean, it's it's. Oh boy, the arm sucks because it lowers, it decreases the level of the hand that we play permanently. We got to get 14 mil here. We got a mulligan hard for multipliers. Okay, we, we're getting we're getting somewhere. I mean, we're not gonna make much of anything here. Okay, 
Let's get the jack first. We can use high cards as discards. Oh man, that this the arm is is a killer. Absolute killer. did get our we got our our glass king so we only have four hands left to play this is going to destroy our high card value so we might as well play the king now while we still have a level two well it's level one now Yeah, we're we're done. Unfortunate. I think the arm is is just ridiculously overpowered. I mean, we rerolled something something so insanely insanely broken. That was really going to hurt us and uh yeah. Maybe, maybe quads can get us out of this. I don't know. No, not even close. Oh, that's frustrating. I, I, I really hate being beaten by a cheap mechanic like that. That's about the worst thing that could have happened because that completely neutered our, our high card plays at all. But what can you do? I'm satisfied with that one. Uh, that's a, that's the furthest I've ever gotten. Uh, anti 11 so far, round 26. But man, that the arm is just awful. And I have I have a feeling that uh, you know, I have a feeling that if I had not re-rolled into the arm, if we just kept the cl our, all clubs debuffed, I could have probably outgamed it. But you live and learn. Thank you for watching, everyone. Hope you enjoyed it. If you did, click the like button. Remember, I'd like to get these. My outro video is so 1,000 likes. The last couple ones are actually really, really close. So please keep on liking these videos. It tells me that you want to see more here on YouTube. And uh, yeah, if the runs get shorter, I will do like a full endless run as well. But as you can see, this one was already 33 minutes and nine seconds. Uh, and uh, these videos are getting longer and longer because more and more strategies starting to starting to come out, which is good, which is good. But, you know, taking... Taking videos and chopping them in half is not ideal, but it keeps people coming back as well as keeping people engaged. So it's kind of give and get. But I do appreciate all the support on the Balotro series. And as always, I'll see you all next time. Until then, so long, everybody.